Alright, welcome. We're here today playing Dot Hack GU Volume 1 Rebirth. Why don't you say hi? What up, General Public? <laughs> it's very polite of you. No, oh, thank you. Um, this will actually be our third playthrough together. Oh, yes. My fourth in total. <laughs> and considering the first one. Oh, so well. It was. Yeah, a failure. It was, it was quite violent. It lasted about two minutes. <laughs> I think there was a death. A lot like my sex life. <laughs> Alright, let's, uh, let's, hop let's right start this. this thing. Yes. And hopefully not have to restart. Again. Again. No, it's fine. I want to, like, at least a million tries on this before we actually nail it. That sounds about right. Yeah. It'll be about next year and we'll finally get past the end. <laughs> yeah, but then Kingdom Hearts 3 will already be out. We'll be over this. Oh. <laughs> I want it. Oh, agreed. I want it now. Oh my god. Is it bad to want it in me? I mean, no, not at all. Okay. I have the word of the Lord in me, which is roughly the same thing. Except, really? Yeah, except I get touched by priests. And... Oh, okay, that that Lord. Got yeah. It. yeah. Some call him Daddy. <laughs> <laughs> you know you love it, guy. Fuck it. Yes. Call me dad. It's, yeah. Oh, I never, father. I never, I never liked people who call their parents daddy and mommy. <laughs> I just, it, it's not that I don't like the person themselves. I just, I can't stand hearing those words. It's just like, ugh. Why are we gonna? Oh, that's a great way to uh, start up with a conversation with your child. You're like, hey, daddy, and he'd be like, you little slut. <laughs> what the hell? What are you? Yeah, call me daddy. I mean, um, <laughs> what do you need, little one? Oh God. Yeah, it's mm, yummy. Oh God. <laughs> Oh, I already see the first spike on a recording, thank god. Sorry everybody's eardrums. No, 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 I... I normalize the audio so it's plus one, negative one decibels, and I compress the audio so that the dynamic range is smaller. So we can get nice and close. Okay. Makes sense. If you really want to, yeah. <laughs> I feel like mine had more vibrato in it. I feel like yours was just like a general whisper. My, mine was very, uh, airy. No, please, don't say no. Sorry, whisper. <laughs> oh, Haseo. Cool. Don't ask me how I remember the name. It's literally been how many years? Five? Six? Hey. Point zero five? We played hey, it like you. a week ago? You, the okay, well, uh, that's not <laughs> what I meant. Yeah, you. I, I didn't mean like you. the last time we replayed it. I meant oh, like the last time we actually actually played this all the way through. Whenever it came out. Wait, hold on. I actually, it came out in 2006. Oh, crap. Where's my... Oh, I don't think I have it yeah. with me. Yeah, I'm just finished for installing it to my PC. Hey. I well, can't even with fucking wish, glasses. I can't see shit. We will be honored to it show you around. Put on down here. Huh? I'm pointing, and the audience can't sure see where I'm pointing. Like at. Come well Use your eyes. You'll find it. Just say yes. And come along with us. If you look really hard, you can see the date it was made on her belly button. Okay. <laughs> if I look real right. close, it's it right decided. inside her vagina. <laughs> the hard thing with the night. 2006. I told you. Member addresses are. Short email oh, speaking of re um, you can only use in the world. Sweet mohawk, by the Short way. Allows you a mohawk. To it's like send he just shoves messages stakes messages in his head. From any player online in the world. He's like Pinhead, but he's <laughs> less dedicated. He got to the third one, he's like, oh, this hurts. <laughs> he's reliving those glory days. The glory days were like premature balls. All right, so let's mm, open the menu. Yeah. Mm. I like how he has like a bowl triangle button to open it. And he's like, like he's like the nerd from middle school who gets into high school and just kind of decides, I'm going to be cool. He's and sort of tries to cut his hair into like this neat little whatever. He's the kid that like... But still didn't quite get it right. Actively gave himself this swirlies a... just to get out of getting him from the jocks. <laughs> he would give himself a swirly so he could tell the jocks that the other group already did to him. So they sort of just like, do it again. oh, well now I don't really want to do it. Kind of like copying. That's, okay. that's dumb. That's stupid. You forgot. God, I hate these tutorials. So, okay. so great. Remember, just so everybody's uh, clarified and up to date. The first game we played, literally, we spent two hours just watching cuts. So, be prepared. <sighs> just a little. It, don't worry. There's going to be quality entertainment the entirety uh, through. So, I mentioned earlier we played through before that beforehand. Mm -hmm. This was the first recording we did. Well, technically second, but the full one we did. <laughs> Two hours, 22 minutes. 
I did this about three days later thinking, well, they're probably, you guys probably aren't going to want to watch this when we're at the actual level we're supposed to be. Right. Doing fights that take five minutes each. <laughs> so I went and did some leveling. All of the extra grinding, including the actual storyline, same amount of time. I was telling you people, don't watch what the, the hell? cinema. Fuck the cutscene. Oh, cares. but I love the cutscenes. It tells you the whole story. The story is my favorite part. If I wanted to read a story, I would go pick this up a Charles. Layers can you choose <laughs> warp many. Uh, I'm much more a fan of interactive of story. You right. I mean, I was like a really big fan of Little Boy Who Cried Rape. Determine the types of area, monsters, and then, but the only difference so is everybody on. came. All right. Well, <laughs> some would say it was a happy ending. <laughs> oh, this oh, is where okay. you input okay, the words. Right. The Oops. thing at the top, you combine the Correct. gyro with the... You can get more... See, the worst part okay. is I don't know when I can actually try. interact with anything. Choose correct. And, and if you people want to read the, the actual dialogue, you can pause the video. Yeah, I'm not, that, okay. I'm not listening to their dialogue. Yeah. Yeah. For the, I don't for care. I'm pretty sure they, the people don't care either, because they're, they're not playing, so they don't need to know what they're doing. Pay attention. Do you guys really need to read that much? Come on, now. If you wanted to read, read a book. <laughs> You're not here to read. You're here to listen us listen to us talk about random things like, and then go on the rest of your day. Hours of shit talking. That is what you signed up for. Can't I don't know about hours. Maybe like 20 minutes. Okay, well for us it's going to be hours. Okay, like fair point. For fair them point. it's going to seem like maybe 15 so, to 30 minutes. It's going to feel like we're coming back to you like every day doing the recording. You know, just, just that one little thing a day. And it's like, just no, we're we'll holding up in a room for like three hours. <laughs> I spent the last two days And then I spend the next week just dying while I do all the editing. As I'm at home doing absolutely shit. Well, so again, the best part is I spent this is probably a good four hours today editing our previous playthrough. <laughs> Which we're not using, by the way. And then I got a call from this guy saying, you know, maybe we shouldn't use that. We were a little racy on that one. This is our mission. As I was finishing the episode, I was like, you fuck. Now, mind <laughs> you, my prior plan was to actually call him the day of, but, you know, being lazy is a 24 7 job. Again, I don't really care. Again, I only got through one episode. It's not like I finished the entire right. series. I mean, for me to like wake up in the morning and masturbate, that's still a lot of work. I mean, I do it for the fans. I mean, you gotta move your hand like up and down and then up again and then down again. I mean, it's a lot of work. I fingers to get tired. I got video games. Yeah, fuck. Shit, am I supposed to? Okay, this does your golf. I just invent like a a pocket pussy. I was gonna say a drill with like a I pocket can... pussy on the end of it, so like ah, it just like whoosh, that was done. That was a post about that on Reddit the other day. Oh, dear God. <laughs> so some dude's like roommate, um, so he like went into his room at one point when the guy was like moving out because there was just shit everywhere, and he found like a drill with just a nice. A, we found an altar. A jury rig masturbation device on the end of a drill. <laughs> And it looked like it was made out of, like, just clear caulk. Like, oh silicon caulk that he had just, like, put... Not cock, C-O-K, C-A-U-L-K. I figured he was just, like, standing in a room with, like, stucco in a bucket and sticking his dick in it. And, like, this should be perfect. <laughs> this is just enough. <laughs> Makes his dick look like a uh, sea cucumber. <laughs> I wanted the wall to just look like my dick. Oh so, my God. <laughs> Every time you walk in the room, you're reminded of me. Oh my god, that's horrible. <laughs> now I'm imagining it. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, but, okay, okay, okay. We're gonna be for real when we talk about some weird shit, but I'm the only person that like, ever thought of the idea of like cutting a hole in your bed and, and placing some kind of sexual device in there. And fucking your bed. I never thought about cutting my bed, but I usually because you have a box spring and your mattress. Right. I always thought about just lifting the mattress and putting something in between. Them. Right. But okay, I'm so pretty sure I'm not alone in that. One. Okay. All right. Oh fuck! I'm supposed to hold down X. I can... Oh Wait, yeah. Why is this guy not dying? So back to video games and not talking about fucking fruits and vegetables. We were talking about fucking fruits and vegetables. Oh no, that was my next point. Oh. Gonna okay. If you're gonna make a stucco wall cut out of your cock, you might as well just fuck a watermelon. <laughs> Like, why did we talk about that? Did I black out for a minute there? I mean, how do you think they serve the wood fire watermelon? Fair point. Fair point. You gotta fuck it first, man. That's true. Don't worry, McDonald's is the same thing that a chicken nugget. That's why they taste so good. <laughs> you gotta fuck the baby chicks in the morning. 
It's that special sauce. <laughs> Two whole beef patty special <laughs> sauce. <laughs> British cheese and onion on a sesame seed. My dear. <laughs> delicious, perfect. Great, I'll get uh, two of those ready for you in a minute. <laughs> I hope they hear the crunching. I mean, right. they're gonna, but maybe. You know, sure, but I'll teach you about using it is an omnidirectional mic, so. I don't want to go out and say some name brands, but it's a cheese nits. Nip cheese. I oh, come on. on. Yeah. Now I'm just imagining something else. From a guy so named Jack. Combo like that guy who saw the belly flop competition. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, mind you people, by the way, we are we are fresh off the um okay. what you fresh off the boat, I guess this is a, Do you see the four you can speak of uh, going to a Preston and Seed concert today? Yeah, woo belly flop contest. Right. Thank God I saw that much white trash in the same spot at the same time. Awesome. I really wanted to see that much. I fell off the wall. I wouldn't say white trash. It was more just middle-aged people that thought they were younger than they were. It was right? so average white that if they took PSSAs, they'd probably all end up in the same career together. Yeah, I can I can see that. Middle management, you know, working your way nowhere. Yep. <laughs> yep. In the same spot for quite some time. I'm sure at least one of them had a respect for it. Like, yeah, working in CBS. Yeah. <laughs> oh, uh, <laughs> two people doing Touché. it. Touche. Touche. Uh, okay, so ba so back to the game. What did All you, right, I'm what supposed to be What did you name your guy by? Is it still Haseo? He can't you can't rename him. Yeah, that's right. So. I'm sorry, it's not New Age MMORPGs. You. So, BT dubs, for all those hit people that don't know what that means. Um, I don't give a shit about to explain. So basically, the two teammates you are fighting with right now, they, they have a secret a plot. So to speak. Oh, you're giving away too much. No, no, I'm not. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna tell them that they double cross it. Or you know, just give him a nice bouquet of flowers and chocolates. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. They get married. There's totally nothing sinister going on. It's totally heterosexual, considering the one dude looks like a vagina. Me. I mean, kind of. Look at that midriff. Jesus I mean, Christ. Right? Like, Haseo's sexy. Come like, on. <laughs> God, it reminds me of my emo days. You just just be a man and just whip it out. Just, just pull it out. Stop stop being so afraid. I, I think that's on the, what's on the back of him. Well, he's got a man stand. He's kind of got like that double dong going on. Well, he's got the... <laughs> <laughs> well, that happens. I think. But a bong bong. No, but seriously. He, he's got the front of him stand. Where's the back of him stand? Mm, he doesn't like butt stuff. It's like pointing to his wiener. <laughs> he likes wiener stuff. Apparently. He's into that. So, so, okay, so he's a lot like me. Just a constant top. He'll never bottom. Oh. Makes sense. That's why you and me would never work. Right, do you hear that? Men, women, toasters, and animals of the world? Fuck, be terrible. I'm coming for you. <laughs> he does not care. I don't. As long as you're medium rare. Right? <laughs> as long as you're over the age of born, <laughs> you're good. Guy, please don't take please don't take that seriously. I hate the adolescent age when you hit like 15 and you start growing hair. God, it's disgusting. <laughs> I mean, I would say you never grew hair, but he did. I just didn't grow in inches. <laughs> Past the age of 12, you just sort of stop. I was like, fuck it. Your body was just like. We're good. <laughs> is this too much work? <laughs> you know how hard it is for me to stand? Your body is just as lazy as you are. <laughs> my, <laughs> my spine was like, nah, you good? You got it? This is way too much weight to hold. I can't do more of this. I'm scared of heights. That's the problem. <laughs> that is the problem. Your body knew. Whoa, man. We're too high. We're awesome way job. too high. we got to stop this All right. shit. God, is anybody else getting dizzy for from this height? This is, oh what is this, God. six feet? Oh. Okay, now use the map to check your I'm position. I'm so tempted to skip like this one. You. <laughs> as I say to him as I look up. Uh, See, that's the problem. Ty likes to, to, you know, be a real YouTuber and actually show the full experience of the game where I am more like, if that shit's not done Full experience? Hours, I'm groaning through the cutscenes. <laughs> <laughs> but you're still watching. I know. It's less that I care about the people and more I care about the story. Now, now, mind you, I had said earlier I really wish I brought my DS so I could just sit here and play video games while he played video games. Ah, but then that would not be engrossing to the story at hand. No, I left my DS at my other house. Damn it. You left your dick sucker at home. I did. Fuck. Mm -hmm. That's what I said. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, no shit, we're talking about the same thing. What the fuck? 
clearly. No, never going through a white door. The uh, the uh, open gates. They say don't go into the light. The legs always of every, go into the light. The legs of every sixteen year old, ever. Ooh ooh. Fun fact. Oh, they're gonna say it in a second. Never mind. <laughs> Forget it. Well, I, so I was about to say a part of the story that's actually part of the uh, history this of is the world. The game will actually the play. Of law. But yeah, they're saying it right there. We just call it's it the false set. Statue. I'm gonna put the uh, headphones over here because I'm hearing. It's oh, you're hearing, hearing the double audio. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I keep forgetting that it does that. See, it's a little talk. confusing considering <laughs> I hear this <laughs> talk and then well, looks, yeah, because that's a little bit delayed because it's actually recording everything. Yeah. So, yeah. It's just like whispering. Like, I keep area. trying to drink it. Oh, can you? Go ahead and open it, Haseo. As I'm sobering sure. up, not by much. Go yeah, ahead. You're kind of a small person. Give me all the help you can get. Fuck myself. All right. Go you ahead. You're still a noob. I don't think I can. I don't think that's how that. I don't think that's how that works. Guy, could you be any more respectable and kiss me goodnight, you fucking fruitcake god? Thanks. Disgusting. Oh, there was that uh, flowers I was talking about. <laughs> those are very sharp flowers. <laughs> the items in the treasure chest. Maybe those aren't flowers. Are your yes, Maybe I've misread this whole situation. Well, if I die young, well, her. To be fair, to be fair, her head kind of looks like a reflation flower. These pathetic noobs. It's it's really like quite fun. <laughs> <laughs> well, but uh, so vile plume is actually designed <laughs> after the Reflasia flower, I, I mean, I, I, to play this and its game. description in the game hey, in the Pokédex is on. actually almost exactly the same description you would hear from somebody who doesn't know what the Reflasia flower is. I mean. After all, I'm not a real person. No, I'm just a Pokémon nerd. Oh, here comes the giant saw sword. Fun fact. That type of broadsword in this game is actually terrible. Also, another fun fact, uh, you cannot make a sword into a chainsaw. Yeah, that's not how shit works. Like, unless you're a gasoline. Gasoline. It's steam powered. That's what the chim chips are. Oh, he's right. I know. Well, if this game was steam powered, it'd be overpriced and really fucking light. It already is. Oh. Damn. So what is well, it? Actually, it's really we, steam powered. we have the cart the the, the case, not the cartridge, the case, <laughs> right here. Battle. So, this game I bought about five years ago. Keep in mind, it came out in 2006. No, it wasn't five years ago, it was like three years ago. Because that's when I was trying to do that. Whole, it, anyway, long story, but whatever. Couldn't find it well, at all. Went to like 12 different game stops, couldn't find this stupid the stupid game. Finally, I talked to one of the guys, basically said, look, I don't care where it is, I'll drive Come like 20 on. miles to go find Say this thing. Hello. It was in like downtown Philly. I, swear. I was in Just the hood. The like, I was afraid I was gonna die. All, all <laughs> and the best part is, I brought my friend Taylor. <laughs> For the rest of you, my friend Taylor is a like 5 foot 3, kind of scrawny looking dude, and he has like hair down to the middle of his back. So if you're sort of looking at him from behind, he kind of looks like a chick. I mean, I know exactly what it looks like from behind, but that's another story. <laughs> that's, that's a very different story. <laughs> but I brought him to downtown Philly. Oh, Lord. Uh, we were a little afraid. <laughs> I bet all the homies wanted a piece of that white girl. But at the end of that, I finally got the game. $25. Which makes no sense. Several years after it had been released. Because nowadays all retro games are so much more. I've found, I found a, a copy well, of Parasite Eve at the store, uh, like a retroactive game store, basically sells all old, old school shit to your gamers. No, oh, I love that place. Yeah, they they were selling Parasite Eve, which is PlayStation One, for one hundred and forty fucking dollars. Jesus Christ! That shit was that shit was barely sixty dollars when it first came out. <laughs> Damn. So I mean, nowadays, like finding a Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask golden copy or. N64 version, Welcome Super Smash Brothers. The world. It, it, it's not even possible at this point. You're gonna spend more money than the friggin' console itself, let alone oh, yeah. the actual game, which blows because I mean, at least when we were younger, we had roughly every fucking console. Yeah, like, I every game. I used to have an entire bag of just like Game Boy mm -hmm. games. I went to look for it the other day because I'm planning on doing a. I guess I haven't told you this yet. I'm planning on doing an entire playthrough of the Pokemon series. None of the remakes are like the third version. The yellow, blue. No, 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 not even that. Like, mm. so you're gonna do uh, red, blue, mm. gold, silver, oh, ruby, right. sapphire. Go all I the way through them. 
but do none of the remakes or like the third versions because like right, for blue and yellow you get like for blue and red like you get the yellow red, version green and red. <laughs> well but green was actually the japanese release i like pokemon green that was actually one of my honestly to this date that was one of my fo favorite pokemon games because it gave you it was all the original 151 remastered really well done and then they also are you sure you're not talking about yellow it. no i'm positive pokemon green i'm talking about the newer one not oh, 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 oh you mean leaf green leaf green yes oh, okay. exactly because you have all the originals, and then it also gives you the opportunity later on to explore the new generations. So it doesn't just stop there. It's like it's really well done. I don't think you're. Huh? No, look how leaf green would you be a leaf for, and you can actually start going to like it's a sale! The PKK! different. I swear. What? I'm pretty sure that was only the second generation. Only. The second generation you could do that. The for, so gold, silver, and crystal, you started in the Johto region. Once you beat the Elite Four, you were able to go to the Kanto region. No, no, no. Pokemon Elite Green and Fire Red did a slight bit as well. You just had to work for more towards it. But yeah, they, they open up like, uh, the second generation right after that to oh. a little bit more. Uh, to be fair, I don't think I ever actually played the Elite Green or Fire Red series just because I didn't really want to. Fair enough. I just, I don't know. I mean, I'm a Dakar one. Oh, I... Johto. That was my favorite one. Well, so the nice thing about it is... So I actually had a tiny bit of um, validation in this pre preference. The first generation was kind of like their test run. Sort of figuring out the way it feels, figuring out how the way it plays, figuring out what they need to add, what they need to get rid of, stuff like that. You go to the second generation, they sort of refine everything. They don't start making any real changes, they sort of just tweak a few things. So they add the... I believe they added Dark and Steel in the second generation. I could be wrong on the Dark one, it's been a while since I've done my research. Um, but they added Dark and Steel to balance out the typing. And they adjusted some of the uh, typing of some of the moves, like um, Bite and Dust, in the original games, were normal type. Right. But in the second gen generation and going forward, Bite and Gust are dark and flying, respectively. Just, again, to adjust the typing so that um, earlier in levels, uh, Pokemon like Pidgey I'm surprised. Right. could have an elemental back. type I guess attack. This means that the rumor about you killing yeah. Because uh, I believe wasn't a lie after the Pidgey all. chain didn't get a flying type attack until Come Wing on, Attack, yeah. which I believe they didn't get until Pretty the early still. 20s. Yeah. Let me apologize. Um, so oh, which took a while. Just in case any of the audience is confused, mind you, Hasei has already basically been killed, and then he came back, and now he's what they would like to call a uh, PKK or player killer killer. He's basically the baddest motherfucker right now. At, for the moment. Oh yeah, the, uh, for the at this point in the timeline, there's actually like Do you urban legends surrounding him. What did you say? Uh, basically being like he's the biggest, legendary hottest PK motherfucker ever. In blue fire. But, they say players and, uh, and it also depends on how far you go back actually back on dot hack huh? because th this game oh come on now yeah, this has been out Don't for quite some time there, there's so many animes and mangas and oh, oh so still out. when i was doing my research the other day um, i didn't realize this but they actually made a anime and manga series that takes place after the gu series which i didn't realize i thought they sort of stopped after the gu right. series they didn't make any new games Except for in Japan, where they made a couple, but meh. Right, right. Um, I think I can. But no, they have. Uh, I think it was uh, Dot Hack X. Hmm. I think that's what it's called. I might be wrong on that, but um, from what little I saw of it, it was basically a portable version of the world. Oh, that's pretty empty. Yeah. Um, but the one. the original copy of the game is actually like an ethereal disc that some kid has, that instead of, like, jacking into the game, kind of like the Matrix and shit, right. his physical body goes to the game. Almost like Sword Art Online. Where they, like, wear the visor, go to sleep. Oh, no, 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 but, like, it, that's what they do in this one. Right. In this one, the, it's a black disc that when he loads up, he himself, like, physically goes into the game. It's like a one-life-only kind of situation there. That's yeah, awesome. a little bit. Sounds a little shitty. So <laughs> kind of. You. One and done, bro. That's it. Yeah. Oh, I actually really like this guy, too. The you like Sakaki? Death. Yes. Because he has be cock in his name? Absolutely. Okay. And he looks like a princess. I mean, who wouldn't want to fuck him now? He's just so annoying. Players. 
Are like, what's that face thing he so wears? No, no, actually, no, it's not him. PKs Who's the other one? Around the world so we'll, 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 we'll see him later. Zelkova, the little kid? PK no, 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 the one that stands in front of the white tree. Oh, 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 um... I don't have time. Oh, what's his name? What's his name? Um, I'm pretty sure he's a wizard. And it earns you nothing. So why? Which is fine in my life. Oh, no, it's fine. He's raging. Oh, yeah. No, he's got the the voice. And I'm I cannot overlook Like, if he stuck it in my butt, it would be... Did you sing way different than it actually sounds? What's that? Yeah. The name of a guild? No, I... God, what is his name? It's really bothering Sorry, me. Sakai, I can't remember. But I've already got enough he's, friends. He's, no, he's definitely one of my favorite he's characters. Badass. Very soft-spoken. Very, mm -hmm. very wise. He also has a huge thing for Haseya. <laughs> yes, it was a huge thing. Did you always I would assume. Like that? Yeah. Uh, yeah, since he's going for you know, I mean, See, I'm telling you, it's under a falcon. Yet. Everybody just wants a piece of that, right? <laughs> I mean, damn, at this point, I kind of do. <laughs> I mean, look how cute she is. Oh, not, not her, I meant to say. Oh, I was talking about her for a second there. Yeah. Oh. Uh, let me just put it this way. Do I you know this person? I say it with her dick. Uh, no. <laughs> it's not like our first recording of this where we gave her a dude cute. voice. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Shit, I forgot about that. Oh my god. <laughs> Hold on. Hold on. The next time she just talks, it's gonna happen. Just a case of identity. <laughs> hey, you. Uh, Why don't you just... Text message. Oh yeah. <laughs> I guess it would look kind of weird if you. He's gonna pull out his razor and check his next tell. Well, but I, so I was like, back to the comparison of this and Sword Art Online. Oh, In this, when a character brings up their menu, you don't see a menu. <laughs> no, agreed. So they sort of just like stare off into the distance, like, oh, I have a text message. So you just see idiots just sort of standing, just like. Uh, I mean, like in any video game ever, Call of Duty, anybody? <laughs> yeah, but at least in Sword Art Online, you get the Why menu in front of you, so it's sort of like, like a, fool. I'm no, doing that's something. Honestly, how I feel in Grand Theft Auto. You'll be standing there checking do. your phone. Nobody you sees another menu. Your character is no staring different at your phone. From the PKs the themselves. Time, they just find it prudent to shoot you with missiles from a fucking jet that they just happened to get, or, or crash into you with a semi truck, and it's like that's fine. All they really wanted to do was go put on a fedora and a monkey face and have a fun time. But now, fuck me. I mean, to be fair, they're gonna do that anyway. <laughs> it's not a matter of you having your phone open, they're just gonna blow you up. Still, still kind of rude. A little bit, yeah. Alright. I'm not arguing that point. What, uh... How are we still in a cutscene? That's, that's what I'm saying. I, I'm feeling like we're drawing close to the time we oh might need to. Um, oh my... Like, this whole episode has basically just been a podcast. Uh, I was gonna say, did you wanna, did you wanna pause and... <sighs> save right before we start meeting some special people? No, it's been a long time. no, I say we I save it. No, we're gonna finish this well, cutscene and then we'll end the episode. Because the I think death. it's okay. No, it's not close. But we're gonna finish it, damn it. Quite strong. <laughs> it's just, our first episode is gonna be roughly like 35 minutes. Yeah, yeah. I, I just, I just don't want to end it like in, in the middle of a cutscene. Because it's such a cop to Always the. I mean, for me anyway, because I hate when people do that. It's kind of like you're in the middle and they're just pausing, like, all right, we're done. It's like, but when the twilight but story. Broke up, I love it when people. Why do didn't you story. come then? <laughs> what have you been <laughs> doing the last <laughs> six months? <laughs> it was such a small <laughs> seed. I needed to find uh, out what was growing inside. <laughs> My dick. There was only one Damn. way to find out. Mm, got him. That's why. Gotham. I decided to. All right, to I think it. I'll try you in the next it? episode what are you to talking start talking about, about all the history that I learned. I'm speaking figuratively. Okay. Yep. I spent a solid like two hours. When you suddenly disappeared, we all you remember? Just... So you know how why when you're you in the, like the menu for the world, After you have your that, desktop and then you have the menu know. for it. So it's like mm -hmm. log in, the community right. forum, and then the like information of the game. Mm -hmm. There's that whole I history know, section you, you can go to, to that nobody ever goes to because fuck that. Wait, anyway, you know, try I read through that whole thing. I mean, or you can just play Six it. months yeah, now. Yeah, no. No, 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 but so come back to the you'd think that, but actually, um, the first game the is the, the World R1, is lying in which account. was the original world, no the original game, the actually completely that. different. Try this game is the World R2, So you knew. Which About is you. actually a yes, but that's all that remake of the first one but that was only halfway done. Try it, you mm. might learn but they were trying to push Chino's it forward, code. so it was actually finished. You may also There's actually a little bit of background to that that I'll get into later. But they were rushing to get it finished, so they actually combined it with another try. game that was finished. Yeah, I can't remember the name of that game, but it, it, I don't think it's ever actually mentioned anywhere. But there's 
It's mentioned somewhere, he but not very prominently, and you have to go searching for it. But anyway. So basically what I'm hearing is they were on the scene of the crime. Yeah. You mean... Um, Again, it's actually buried in the history and parts of the story from the first game and some of the animes. Um, actually, what happened in between the end of the original game and the beginning of this one. Um, because the owner of the game is CC Corp. And they're sort of a... I'll get my chance. We'll say shadowy organization. I swear I'll bring Shino back. I'll they have certain members work. that kind of yes. just decide they're going to do something We're the only and don't tell anyone. Possibly bring her back. Um, that was one of the big the issues with the first game. Ones. That was actually how you got the uh, Twilight oh, bracelet mm -hmm. and the whole I'll data drain thing. Whole I honestly, the, I gotta say, there are some original things Dot Hackers are just do. the best games out there. It was... I mean, there wasn't nothing to. Well, too it was complex. because it was very innovative. Right. It was kind of like the first of its kind. It was kind of like, oh, I can sort of like decide where I'm going and like make my right. own whatever. I mean, there wasn't much for vanity, so you couldn't really have much alpha change. But I mean, the well, fact you that can't have that in this game. You basically get your weapons. Right. But that's it. what I'm saying. Though. The fact that you could actually change your weapons and they really be visually back. show a difference. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Is a huge step in, in gameplay because. I mean, nowadays, that's that's basically what everybody wants. They want a game that they can it's visually see here. something growing mm -hmm. and, and becoming stronger. Whether it just be like if they're wearing eyeliner or running around with a purple dildo beating the shit out of people. Just I think you just described Grand Theft Auto 4. Or Saints Row. Whatever. Yeah, yeah. I think it might be more Saints Row, actually. <laughs> the, the eyeliner makes it Saints Row. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The purple dildo is both. It, it is. It really is. God, you remember in, um, I think it was, was it Vice City? But you had to go into the cop station, and it was mm -hmm. in the showers. Yep. It was just a purple dildo. That and then you, they did. you picked it up. It was a weapon, so the mm -hmm. cops came. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and the best part was, you didn't whack with it. You thrusted with it. <laughs> too bad for that one cop that just comes running in, running in a little too low, and he's like, "Stop!" <laughs> He'd be like, "Oh my god, why did you thrust at my tonsils?" <laughs> I'm sorry, it was an accident. No wonder. I'll I'll I'm gonna do it again, in. though. <laughs> Can aim lower this time. I wouldn't worry about your throat. You might want to clench. Nine and, <laughs> Nine and a half hour cutscenes later, we are oh. still here looking at this girl's neckline. Again, more of a podcast this round. Poor Hasea, the LSD is kicking in. Oh, I think Let's... that'll probably be the name of this episode. Really more of a podcast. <laughs> How many cutscenes can we friggin' watch? Let's find out. All oh, of them, actually. Look who it is. My main main. Oh, what did we call him last time? I know we're not gonna <laughs> <Should> we? <laughs> I don't know if we should. Well, we called him like four different things. I think we ended on Zelda. Did we? Oh, yeah, because the Triforce. Yeah. yeah, the Triforce, yeah. Because he's Tri Edge and you said he various like things that were not happy things. Yeah, they were not uh, family friendly. Most of what you say is not family friendly. <laughs> That's why I'm keeping an SFW for this episode, at least. Yeah. You're, You're trying. Right. Very hard, actually. You're I'm, I'm very impressed. Burn in hell for a fact. Man, there it is. <laughs> yeah, you get one. <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty darn good this whole episode. 33 minutes of me barely saying anything anti-Semitic or ignorant or yeah. slur, so... Although, to be fair, that term really isn't that out there. No. no. And I feel like, for the most part, there's a very secluded sect of people that would actually be offended by that. God, I hope some dude in the panda suit comes to my house and jerks me off. I mean, beats me up. I mean, beats me off, whatever. So. Whichever you prefer. Yeah. Fur again. <laughs> we said fur. Oh, look, it's the giant chainsaw sword it's powered the by. Purple Dominator? Sh shitty steam. <laughs> it's a 1080p at the same time, so it's a 90p altogether, people. We made oh, this joke last time. That was too. the one we made the last yeah, time. Yeah, but the only difference is it, it, I'm pretty it, sure. Yeah, I it's mean, 10 and 80p. That's the same thing. Yeah, not, 90, not 1080. 10 and. <laughs> Dude, I would totally lose my virginity to. This guy killed kind of. Both of them? Zelda. At the same time? Kind of. Well, I mean, first off, you would have to assume that they both have penises. But I mean, most anime guys and like females. You know, so I'm sorry if I just punched them. I got a little excited talking about it. Well, so, hold on a second, there's actually an interesting point, um, a lot of animes that I've seen always end up having that one dude character that looks like a chick, and the, for the first episode you're kind of like, what? I'm a lucky girl, that's a little weird, alright, so I can, I can live with it. Next episode they just go off on that character, he's like, you're a lucky girl. 
And they just all start like making fun of him, like trying to put like pigtails in his hair, trying to dress him up. It's like, damn. Suck to be that dude. Oh, or on High School Host Club, great anime. Oh. But that shit just makes me laugh so hard because it's a trick the entirety of the time, oh and you're God. like, that is, like, is that a guy? Oh. Like, I'm so conf- I, And I like what they did, the classic uh, 180, because most anime mm-hmm. made mm-hmm. feminine looking males, and they decided to make a manly looking female. Well, to be fair, most of the men in that anime look like girls in the way, so. I mean, I, I really think, especially, I forget the name of them, but the two Ginger Brothers, they like. Oh, 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 um. Um. Um, Hikaru and Kaoru. Uh-huh. I just, <laughs> yeah, there you go. I feel like most of the time they're just really trying to wiener touch. And they just won't. Yeah. Uh, I, mean, I mean, as is most of that, I mean, I'm pretty well, sure they're all trying to wiener touch. There's actually one episode, um... Oh, and by the way, audience, Haseyu has died, what is it, for the second time now? Yes. Hmm. This time is worse, though. He's really doing a great job keeping on. Oh, and this... There we go. Finally. Holy shit, I can actually do something. <sighs> All right. Well, All you right. know what? I think we're going to end up right I think, here. <laughs> I think that's the end of the episode. Um, <laughs> the 35-minute drag holy on. It's crap. cool. Wow. Don't worry. We only have an hour and a half left before we're done with cutscenes, and we can actually start playing. Yeah. This has been long. Wonderful. Thank start. you so much for sticking around, <laughs> assuming you did. Uh, we'll see you in the next one. Aha. Uh-huh. I might be here. Bye-bye. Adios. Adios.